Welcome to another episode of How You Cuff Feelin'. It's another early morning for me, and so there's nothing that I'd like more than a hot cup of coffee. Get my day going, get me revved up. And so for today's episode, I'll be drinking Bulletproof's The Mentalist. Uh, and so on the bag, it's described as a medium dark roast, and it's described as rich and nutty, which is probably how most billionaires would describe their scrotums. And The Mentalist is the name of the coffee. Of course, immediately when I see those words, I think of the CBS TV show starring Simon Baker and Robin Tunney. And it was one of those shows that lasted eight seasons. I never watched a single episode, yet somebody must have been watching it because somehow it's in syndication now. But anyway, on that show, I guess Simon Baker was a psychic investigator. Is there psychic qualities to this mentalist? Well, let's find out. So to understand why Bulletproof calls it the mentalist and what Bulletproof coffee is all about, obviously we can read the bag. So Bulletproof asks you, how clean is your coffee? And it says all coffee has good stuff like polyphenols and other antioxidants, but coffee can also have high levels of mold toxins ew, that rob you of your natural energy and mental agility day after day after day. I certainly feel that way, I don't know about you. So this coffee is farmed, screened, and tested for toxins according to the bulletproof process, which is trademarked, uh, leaving you free to be your awesome self every day. Well, that's pretty exciting. I appreciate that scientific approach. Not sure I appreciate the assumption by bulletproof that all us coffee drinkers have self-confidence. I mean, some of us are just trying to plow through this hell with some coffee, right? Now, Bulletproof and this kind of coffee really comes off as some Joe Rogan level type stuff. Not surprising. So here is how to make your coffee Bulletproof according to the bag. You start with eight ounces of filtered water fresh off the boil. You add two and a half tablespoons of ground coffee from Bulletproof and brew. And then you add one to two tablespoons of grass fed unsalted butter and one serving of Bulletproof Brain Octane Oil. Then you blend until frothy and enjoy. Now while I expect, or excuse me, respect that process, I'm not looking to consume more butter, whether grass-fed or not grass-fed, and I'm not willing to invest in Brain Octane Oil. As exciting as that sounds, I also and I appreciate that our brains may be like our cars, but I'm just imagining pouring motor oil into my coffee and drinking it. And it that brain octane is really, yeah, it's, I'm not going to do it is all I'm saying. But that doesn't mean that I wouldn't invest in a bag of bulletproof mentalist coffee and just give it a shot without the bulletproof components to it. So let's go ahead and go mental on this coffee straight up. I ground the beans, the medium dark roast, and let's go ahead and have a sip of the mentalist, non-bulletproof style. I guess the mentalist if you're hit by numerous bullets. Here we go. Mm. And still without this additional butter and brain octane oil, I, I still enjoy this cup of coffee. It is a pretty good cup of coffee. Mm. You know, is it rich and nutty? Yeah, it seems that way. And I can only imagine how much more vibrant it is with brain octane oil and butter. But again, uh, my approach to drinking coffee is to just have a normal cup of coffee. Whether it enhances my brain or not, I don't really care, man. You know, it's just it's life and just trying to get through my day. But nevertheless, I still do feel this is a pretty good cup of coffee. I do think it retails usually about $15 a bag, you know, that extra brain octane, and God knows how much more you'd be spending on grass-fed unsalted butter and brain octane oil if you want the full bulletproof max. But again, I got this at Sprouts on sale for, I believe, 12 bucks, so you could find it, give it a shot. Again, I think it's a pretty good cup of coffee, and uh, I'm going to enjoy it for the rest of 
this day. Well, let's enjoy another sip and uh, mm. if you're wondering how I'm cough feeling, well, I'm feeling bulletproof, nothing to lose. Fire away, fire away, ricochet, do a day, fire 